If you're on the way to Ocean City and hear the sounds of cheering around Salisbury, mm -hmm. it might be coming from the family in the car next door because they're anticipating a vacation. Or it could also be the crowd that you hear at Purdue Stadium watching one of the best teams in minor league baseball. WMAR 2 News' Sean Stepner explains from the Eastern Shore. They are the most successful minor league team in the Orioles organization this year. We've been winning lots of games and it's contagious. Everybody likes to keep winning. The class low A Delmarva Shorebirds. They've already made the playoffs as first half champions of the South Atlantic League's Northern Division. They're leading the Sally League with an overall record of 65 and 28. That clubhouse is incredible and uh, mix that with a little bit of talent and uh, then you get something like this this season. Leading the way is the pitching. The ace, 19-year-old Grayson Rodriguez, the Orioles' 2018 first-round pick and number one prospect in their farm system. You know, it's been fun. Uh, this is my first full season of professional baseball, and uh, so far it's been great. When he's pitching, I don't get much action out there. You can honestly say in the outfield, you, you, it's almost like a day off. He's got the makeup, he's got the ability, he's got the talent, but then to see him really ex exceed expectations has been super fun to watch. I mean, he's a star. Rodriguez is 7-2 and two in 13 starts with a 2-1-5 ERA and 87 strikeouts. He was part of the Futures game during All-Star Weekend, pitching a scoreless inning. With the O's rebuilding, it's all about the young prospects. In this organization, he may be on the fast track to the majors. It might be easier, but, you know, making it to the big leagues is hard no matter what. You know, there's lots of great prospects, so you're all competing against one another. Uh, you're, all, you're all working for a spot. Uh, on the big league team, ultimately. Some new faces could soon be working with them in Salisbury. With the Major League Baseball trade deadline fast approaching, the Shorebirds could actually be getting even more talent on their roster as the Orioles are expected to sell off big league assets for prospects to help foster the rebuild. The MLB trade deadline is July 31st. We could get better, I mean, which is kind of scary to say. It would be awesome to see a real just to see a real powerhouse minor league organization. Looks like the birds are on their way. In Salisbury, Sean Stepner, WMAR2 News.